Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. Welcome back to the land of Flanders. Last episode, we colonized Manhattan. Good times. Of course, we have to go to Manhattan. And today, we are sending over some... Uh, we're sending over a conquistador with 12 troops so you can go explore a little bit of whatever this is over here, this new world. Uh, a very weird looking new world. There's no other way to put it. It's awkward, it looks weird, and the Shia Caliphate is invading Mali. Again, what for this time? The Khanum Bornuan conquest of Dendi. What? So Khanum Bornu apparently is at war with Mali, and they are allied with the Shia Caliphate. Interesting. Are you guys Sunni? Yeah, Sunnis. So Sunnis are allied with the Shia. Oh. Okay, good to know. Italy is apparently at war with Sicily. Oh, Italy hates us now. Really? Why for dost thou hate me? He desires Kaivoy and Lyon. Okay, so he wants some of my land. Fair enough. But you can't have it, can you, Italy? You just can't have it. You can't handle this. Anywho, we were... Well... We have our points that we need to get uh, one of the reforms through, but people don't want to vote for it yet, and it's mainly because we have overextension. So we need our vassal down here to core Armagnac so we can sell him Nafaroa, and then we also need to sell him Aragoy. So if you would please just kindly core that shit, little vassal, please to be coring. It'd be nice if he would core that, but so far, no luck. Now we could also go for some Polish land, and I think that's... Uh, a definite possibility. He's got some rebels over here. What are these? Pomeranian Patriots. I like that. Go Pomeranian Patriots. Maybe maybe they'll get some land flipped out of Polish terror, Polish uh, Polish hands. But I doubt it. We'll see. Can we form Netherlands? Yes. Uh, we have to tech up to tech 10 first. We're almost there, but we're not there yet. Alright, keep doing military buildings. Can we do a level 2 fort anywhere? Apparently, where? Earth Rampart. Oh, the Azores, of course. Forgot about the Azores. Get that fort, baby. Anytime you colonize, you get those forts in. Obviously, the islands need the forts more than anything else. Otherwise, you just have rebels succeeding in the islands very, very easily. Okay, diplomats are coming home. So who needs hugs? My sin. You want some hugs? You got hugs. Improve relations. Uh, who else wants hugs? Mecklenburg. They love us. Bremen could use a hug. Wow, look at that. He wants freedom, East Freedom, Weed, Osnabrück. Why do you want all my land, Bremen? What's the dealio, yo? Pomeranian Patriots? I wonder who they're going to flip to. Yeah, Poland's got some rebels right now. I like that. Cessation of church function is over, meaning we get some more taxes now. More taxes! Come on, little ship. Little ship of freedom. Ooh. Spend 282 ducats to gain army tradition or lose prestige. I don't have that money, and I probably won't anytime soon, so sorry. Thanks, but no thanks. Much as I would love 20 more army tradition, I just can't afford that. Alright, come on, drop them off. It's okay. Come on. There you go. Alright, so what do we got? We got 6, 2, and 4. Uh, we'll leave one soldier and one cannon at home. And the rest of us are going exploring. Little conquistador man. With a little conquistador plan. Let's go check out the new world. I don't know what's going to be over here. But since our boats, with our explorer Garrett something or other, whoever that was, Garrett the moron, he couldn't discover anything. He probably wouldn't know that he had hands if they weren't attached to his body. Now, we can't sell the Basque provinces until he cores Armagnac. Uh, you cannot overextend your vassals. When you sell them land, they have to finish coring before you can sell them another one. And he has not even started coring over here, so if he would please just hurry the hell up and core that, I would be a happy man. But so far, no luck. He's just dragging his feet, taking it slow, which I guess is not the end of the world. All right, do we really need relations here? I mean, I guess we might as well. Keep them happy. Oh, look, rebels. Double rebels on the same day. Really? The same day? Wow. That's nice. I love getting same-day rebels. Same bat time. Same bat channel. Okay. 
Come on, little conquistador man. Find me shit. Find me shit. Come on. What's out here? Something? Wow, it takes a long time to go. <laughs> a really long time. Whoa. There he is. Alright, good. And our troops are over here. Let's go kill some rebels. Yoink. Our vassal is still not coring. I guess he had to save up some points. That's fine. We lost a claim on Dauphin. That's okay. We'll just get it again. Uh, in the meantime, let's get some more buildings. Uh, where? Where can we do an armory? Madeira. Okay. Why not? Oh shit, our money. Ah, just attack him. Fuck it. What could possibly go wrong? Son of a bitch. Die when I kill you. There we go. Good times. We'll just stand there and keep the revolt race down. Oh, Germany is no longer excommunicated. Really? That means the king died? King Matthew Carlin? Yeah. Oh, and he has no heir. Neat. Let's see. Okay, come on home here. Let's go ahead and excommunicate this bastard once more. New cardinal time. Got it. Got my thumb on the cardinal ship. The Curia. The Curia. More like the Flanderia. There we go. Excommunicate Germany once more. Take that, Germany. Son of bitch. Uh-oh. Spread of disease. I don't have 40 ducats. I wish I did, game. Well, we'll see if we get 40 ducats somehow. Come on, explore! How long does it take to walk? A long time, apparently. Go! Go! We're trying to discover stuff. Molly will release Ashanti and Ghana. Okay. Okay, that's not so bad. So the Shia Caliphate didn't get anything out of that war. That's nice. Oh, shit, we're at max points. Shit! All right. What do we got? How many years ahead? We're five years ahead. I think at this point we just take it. Oh, that's painful. What a waste. But hey, we get tertio infantry now, which is really, really nice. Oh, man. Do I want tertio or free shooter? Well, free shooter gets a little more offensive morale and shock. Tertio is very balanced. And it's a more defensive unit. I think I'll take the, the free shooter. I like being on the offense. God, I can't believe we teched up five years early. Oh, well. Try to sausage their pain. Let us sausage their pain. Hmm. Come on. Can I sausage your pain? There's the money. Now we're broke again. All right. Love being broke. Good times. Yeah, it's going to be a whole nother month before this guy even arrives in Omaha. Omaha? Really? Okay. Apparently Omaha is right next to Acadia. All the provinces in the New World is kind of glued together in various arrangements. It's a little awkward. Oh, there we go. 12 out of 13. So yeah, even with this overextension, they're still interested in voting for it. So let's work on the people who are kind of on the bench, or on the on the fence. Bohemia, Bavaria, Baden, and Croatia. Croatia. All right, I can work on that. Bohemia. Yeah, I can work on that. Baden. Yeah, let's work on it. Invade Argentina. Um, I don't know where Argentina is. But we could try. In fact, I'm pretty sure there is no... I mean, you, you mean La Plata? We can try to find La Plata. Uh, Peru, Mexico... I don't see La Plata. There's Guyana. If we find La Plata, we can invade it. But otherwise, I don't know. It doesn't look like it's a possibility. Yep. 
Italy just annexed Sicily. Goodbye, Sicily. Come on, one more vote. One more vote. One more year. What? What happens to Curie if we convert to Reformed? They just get new... Uh, they get new Cardinals. vote please please to be has more vote no still not damn do we want to convert to reform yes definitely this whole curia thing it's just a phase it's just a phase Damn it, still no. Also, when can we release Galicia? That is the question. Oh, right now, apparently. Our truce is up. Alright. Uh, Mycin, get out of there. Wait, is Mycin voting for me? Yes, they are. Alright, yeah, get out of there. We'll go ahead and release Galicia. I didn't want them as a vassal anyway. Bestow grace? Nah. Nah. Well, maybe. Well, maybe. Who's voting no? Obotrites, Corinthia, Ulm. Ulm. Ulm is voting no. Here, have an Imperial Grace. Doink. Still no. In fact, bestowing Imperial Grace made someone choose to vote against us. I don't know who it is, but that sucks. We spent one point, and now people are voting against us because we spent one point. So that that didn't work. That was that backfired actually. Well, that sucks. That sucks, donkey balls. Damn it, Ulm. How dare you? I am disappointed, Ulm. Ulm. Why are we releasing Galicia? Because it's supposed to be their Reconquista, not ours. We're just helping. We are enablers. Ah, oh, there's Ontario. Man, Susquehannock is a big native, and so is Cherokee. Wow. Guys are up in arms. Bohemia, Bavaria, Switzerland, Salzburg, Nyatra, Slavonia. All right, Cambrai has cord. Less overextension. There we go. So we got a little bit less overextension. Now people want this. So this will do. We get an extra diplomat. We get more reputation. And all the members get less revolt risk. I'm sure people will like that. It also gets rid of all of our 62 authority. So now that the now that our authority is gone again, we can go back to uh, adding provinces to the empire. If I can find any. Oh, yeah, down here. Sure. Oh, that's right. We need to convert, we need to convert chain mail first. Well, damn. I forgot we still had to convert chainmail. We're going to have to look for an advisor, or else that's not going to be a possibility. Advisor time. Missionary strength. Oh, fuck, he's a level 3? I can't afford 17 ducats a month. Well, that's not entirely true. I can if I fire this guy. Who that might be a possibility. If I do that, though, we're kind of... No, it's probably okay. I mean... Well, I do need these ideas. This advisor is allowing us to take our exploration ideas. Because our king has zero diplomacy. So... 
without this guy, we're, we're just really handicapped. Is there a... I think I have to keep him. As much as I want to convert Chainmail, it is not as important as being able to do our colonizing. So we'll have to wait on the conversions, unfortunately. The quality of our troops is impressive. I agree. There we go. There we go. And then I guess just go back to Manhattan because that's pretty much all the exploring we can do without getting military access, which is fine. All right, goodbye Galicia, enjoy your freedom. We'll lose 25 prestige, that's okay. And he's very upset. Our overlord has abandoned us. Negative 200 relations. Dude, I freed you from the Shia. Quit your bitchin'. Really. Quit your bitchin'. My goodness. What a jerk. Oh, you gave us independence. Why would you do such a thing? I don't know. Anyway, improve relations, please. There we go. And I think this is a good time to maybe go to war with Poland. Because he's currently in a war that he is losing. Uh, and we have the Imperial Band C B on him. His allies are not that impressive. Norway, Lithuania, and Finn. So yeah, let's go beat him up. Asturias does not want to go to that war. That's fine. Uh, do we have... We're going to have military access, right? I mean, we're the emperor, so we get access through all the HRE lands. Yeah. We'll go beat up Poland. Make him release some stuff over here. Why not? Imperial Ban on Danzig? No, we'll declare for uh, Oberlausitz. What's the highest base tax over here? Maybe Roklaw. Maybe Vorpalmern. I mean, they're all the same. We'll declare for Roklaw. Whatever. Declare for Roklaw. Done. I don't need peace for anything, do I? Mm, oh, I need to sell land to my vassal. Are you coring this yet, vassal? He is not... Look at this! This lazy-ass vassal, he's just sitting on his butt. He's got his thumbs firmly inserted into his rectum, and he is refusing to core this land. That means I can't sell him anything. Son of a bitch. But yeah, Poland doesn't really have an army, so it's fine. Alright, everybody. Invasion of Poland in three, two, one. Go. Don't attack your country. Well, you certainly picked the wrong country, didn't you? My goodness, you should have chosen wisely. You chose poorly. Invade Poland. Aw, oh, Finn dishonored the call. But Norway's in. Hmm, Norway's in. Hello, Norway. Nah, I'm going to leave Norway alone. I think I'm going to leave Norway alone. I do have my... I do have a lot of ships over here. Nah, we'll leave Norway alone. Poland! You have imperial land and you will pay. Son of a bitch. Ah, more stuff. Unama kick. Great. And diplomats are coming home. Alright, who needs hugs? Uh, let's give a nice industrial strength hug to Selly. And also the Obotrites. Yeah, let's finish off the Obotrites. There you go. Enjoy. Interesting is interesting thing is my vassals. Oh wow. Pomeranian Patriots are sieging Pomerania. What? The primary culture of Pomerania is Pomeranian. And Pomeranian Patriots are sieging Pomerania. It is a Pomeranian province that is owned by Pomerania, who is Pomeranian culture, and they want to flip it. What the actual fuck? I don't pretend to know, but that's very weird. Hey, we got a new cardinal! Yep, hello everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We are in the land of Flanders. 
We're at war with Poland. Because these sons of bitches... Oh, I tell you, these sons of bitches, man. They, uh... They have... They have HRE lands, and that's just not cool. What's his tech? He's two techs behind us. Fantastic. That is what I like to see. He's also at war with Sweden, so... Yeah. Oh, rebels. Get out of here, rebels. It's my colony. Aw, oh, shit. Really? We're black flagged? I mean, it doesn't matter. I guess that means we can explore with impunity over here. So, you get black flagged when you're in uncolonized territory. I did not know that. Now I do. Persia will cede Kerman and Kohistan to the Samanids. Persia will give Artabil and Gilan to the Sunni Caliphate. Wow. Persia is getting absolutely wrecked. So the Samanids have a coastline now. Look at that. The Samanids have a coastline. Neat. Good for you, Samanids. You know, I'm going to get some claims on the Shia Caliphate over here. Can we do that? There we go. Let's go for uh, Barcelona, if you don't mind. Oh, yeah, my vassals are actually beating up Poland and Lithuania. Wow. That's pretty awesome. Vassalize Ulm, prove relations with the Elector of Tyrol up to 100. I think we can do that. We're at... No, we're at 12. Oh, he desires a province. Well, that's never going to happen. Grant export licenses. Let's see. Tyrol's opinion goes up by 20. Lose 10 legitimacy. Mm, and we get a five-year bonus to our national tax. I think I'll do that for 10 legitimacy. Sure, why not? Use black flag to explore without access. Oh, yeah, huh. I guess we could do that. There we go. Oh, I can't order him into fog of war anymore. With the black flag, I cannot order him into fog of war. Well, that sucks, so go over this way. I'm not sure how that's supposed to work. Whatever. So what do we want to do with Poland? I'm not sure. I really don't have a set goal for Poland here. But uh, he is a rival, so declaring war on him is great for our power projection. We're just going to keep on declaring war on people who are our rivals. Like Germany and now Poland and uh, oh here we go Persia will cede a Serbishan and Hamadan to Byzantium. Wow, wow, fucking hell, Persia. He is getting there. There is gonna, there is not going to be a single Zoroastrian province within like 15 years. It's going to be all gone. Very sad day. Goodbye, Zoroastrians. And now we can tech up, finally. I mean, at this point, we might as well just wait until uh, the next year just to see if the price goes down. It probably won't, but it's worth a shot. All right, we're going to split in half, send some more morons down the line. We lost a general, but that's okay. Uh, split in half, move on. Just siege all the things. I still don't know why Pomeranian patriots are sieging a Pomeranian province that's owned by the nation of Pomerania, whose primary culture is Pomeranian. But there it is. I don't understand. Uh-oh, here we go. We're getting attacked by these stupid Pomeranian Patriot Rebels, which is incredibly odd. I think I'm gonna, just going to let them do whatever they want to do. Can I get out of the way in time? Nope. Nope. Uh, well, let's just hope and pray that we get out of the way in time, because I don't want to kill these guys. I want them to succeed. You know what I mean? No, we got caught. I'm just going to run away. 
Alright, we got out of there. Good. Oh! The rebels disappeared. What? The rebels just... Oh! They flipped Stettin. They flipped Pomerania. Yeah, so Pomerania does not exist anymore. Shit, we're down 24 princes again because Pomerania doesn't exist. They flipped the nation of Pomerania to Weligrod. What? What? That is so weird. That is so weird. Yeah, we can support the rebels, I guess. We can try that. The Pomeranian Patriots. Three ducats a month. Um, give them like give them like nothing. There. Oh, and Lubeck also defected to Weligrod. Okay. No, that's fine. If all this land wants to flip to Weligrod, that's great, because Weligrod's in the Empire. I think all of this land is Pomeranian, am I right? Yeah, all the stuff that's up here is Pomeranian, so that's why it's flipping. Italy has declared war on Byzantium. Ooh. Ooh, I gotta see this. Byzantium versus what? Byzantium versus Italy and Toulouse. And then Italy versus, ooh, Austria, Corinthia, Bohemia, and Byzantium. Okay, so that might be an interesting fight. Uh, but Byzantium did just finish a war with Persia, so he might have some really hurt units. Who knows? I'll have to see. So these are all... These are all Czech and Polish. Polish, Czech. Yeah, they're all Czech and Polish. Polish, Polish. Polish, okay. Oh, here we go. The Protestant Reformation. All right, Meissen, we need a diplomat. We're going to demand your conversion right now. You have no excuse. Slow down time, actually. Demand religious unity. Yay, wayward sheep returns. Now, does that piss him off? No, it does not. Okay, so it only pisses off nations who are the same religion as the nation that you demanded conversion from. So, since there were no other reformed nations, uh, nobody can be pissed off. Interesting. We'll have to keep an eye on the religious map mode here, see if anyone else flips. Oh wow, Lithuania is coming back. What's up, Lithuania? You got an army, do you? It's cute. Real cute. How goes our little explorer douche? He is done exploring, apparently. And he did not discover anything. All right, well, come back to the colony. We'll resupply there, get the black flag gone, and then we can go back to doing whatever it is we do. Whatever it is we do. All right, so only the one province, really? And it's Reformation. Not so amazing yet. How goes the war between, uh, oh, the spread of Protestantism. Liege goes Protestant, okay. How goes the war between Byzantium and Italy? Uh, so far, Italy's winning, okay. Oh, Slavonia might flip. Interesting. I wonder if we can demand conversion of uh, a nation who's not independent. Oh, and he, he is finally coring Armagnac. Yay, my vassal is finally coring Armagnac. Took him a while, didn't it? Yep, there goes Liege. Oh, goodness. Oh, you converted. Hey, numbnuts. There you go. Excellent. 
we should send Diplomat to improve relations with that guy. Because he's a little upset. Okay, we got a claim on Barcelona. Good times, good times. Good times, good times. And it'll probably be smart of me to kill my vassal's rebels so that he doesn't lose all those points that he spent trying to core this damn thing. Uh, can I afford to bring an army home? Not really. I guess we'll take these two guys home as soon as they're done. But it looks like by that time they're going to be done with this siege. Alright, drop off a dude. Go to patio. Drop off a dude. Go to patio. And drop off a dude and go to Patio. Hurry up. We might not even get there in time. Come on, little nations. Go ahead and flip religions. I'll be waiting and watching. Snipe them. Ooh. Idea bulb time. Global tariffs. Uh, we're going to need our points for the peace deal, but I'll do it anyway. Why not? We also get naval leader fire. Next up is a second colonist and then naval force limits. Cool. You know what, though? We're out of time for this episode today. Thank you guys for joining me. I have been Shen. You have been you. Our colony is going just fine. Cape Verde and Manhattan. We're only getting 40 per year, but eh, it's okay. Uh, in the meantime, we're at war with Poland to reclaim some HRE lands from him. It's too bad my vassal is unseaging what the rebels are doing. But it might flip before, uh, he before he sieges it. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.